Okay, so today I'm going to be doing a tutorial, again inspired by Ray. Um, it's in her most recent video, which is like a side bun thingy. Like one braid on the side and some twisties, which just adds a more interesting look. So, um, it's not exactly how she does it. I kind of changed a little, um, I don't know, some of the stuff just because my hair is cut differently so I mean if you have more short layers on top then I advise you to do it this way just because the other way I think her length seems a little longer than mine so um that's it so hope you guys like it I'll probably bored you guys to death ah, I don't care but um yeah that's it bye but um what I did was, I woke up, instead of shampooing my hair, because when I wake up it's really greasy, so I just, um, w like, wet it, and then, like, put a little conditioner in it and washed that out. And then, when my hair is still damp, I started out with Chi Silk Infusion. It's a heat protectant, and it softens, and, um seals your splans. Then Garnier Fructis Smoothing Milk. This is um, an anti-frizz um, serum so it just keeps your hair nicely in place. And then I use um, Bedhead Manipulator and that just basically um, gives you more control to your hair. And I already teased my roots, as you can see, and did my bangs. And what I used is this Aussie um, volumizing hairspray. And I just teased the roots. So that's basically it. So what I have here is a 1 inch um, curler, curling iron. This is from Hot Tools, provided by beautychoice.com. And the setting is high. And these curlers usually range pretty low, like they're um, an affordable price range, about around $30. So, what I'm going to do is just basically curl my hair, um, just in all directions. But usually the face framing layers are the ones that I want to um, be away from my face. So it doesn't really matter um, what the direction is for your hair because later on you're going to put it to the side anyways. And what you want to do is put it mid strand, roll it in and then pull it so then it reaches to the end and then roll the rest in. So I'm going to finish this up and I'll get back to you when I'm done. So I have already curled my hair. It's a little warm, so I'll let it um, settle down a little. And I left my curling iron on just because I'm a big klutz and I might forget. So what I'm going to do now is just kind of try to not mess the curls up, but just loosen them. Oh, you see, look, I already missed a piece. So try to only touch the curls that are just cooled down. So this is the side I started out with. So I'll do that first. And then I'll put it to the side. Like this. And now I'm going to take a section of my hair. Um, preferably my... I'm going to take it and bring it to the side where my bangs are. I think it'll look a lot cuter with a bun like on that side. Just take a little piece. I think this is good. I don't really want too much hair just because I have really thin hair to begin with. And do is curl it into a bun like that. And then pin it. Hmm. 
you can always add more here and just bring it to the side. I have short layers, so what I'm going to do is just kind of pin it so it kind of matches in like that with the bun. So it more or less creates an illusion of a bun just because I have shorter layers. So I'm just going to like take more little strands and just make it into like a circular shape. Just pin it. Okay, on this side, what I'm going to do is make a braid. So, divide into three pieces. And just basically braid it. Mm. Instead of using rubber band, I'll just put a little hairspray at the end. And then bring the rest of this hair over to this side. I'm going to take this strand that frames my face, twist it away from my face. And then a strand from this side that's long enough to reach over. And twist it away from my face. kind of difficult to do this with one hand. Bring it over. So I have two twisties. And this is going to hold my hair so it stays on this side. So what I do is just cross them. A little hairspray just to help them hold. And then pin it. Do you like a cross motion with your bobby pins? A crisscross? And just mess it up a little. So that's what it'll look like. And I have a little headband. Hope you guys enjoyed it.